I'm Candy Flores. I'm Abilene's fire chief. I've been a firefighter since March two, uh, 1992, so for 30 years. It, it's a little embarrassing. Um, I, I did not uh, anticipate becoming a firefighter ever. Uh, a friend of mine wanted to come test to be a firefighter and he didn't want to come by himself, so I went with him and uh, I ended up passing and just kind of kept going and kept going. And uh, about the fire service, uh, it's a very, very fulfilling job. I mean, being able to, to help others, uh, knowing that the work that you do is directly affecting people's lives. Uh, you get immediate results. I don't want to act like I'm old, but there's definitely, it's, it's a whole different fire service now. Um, from when I first came on to where we are now, it's, it's just apples and oranges. I mean, we progress so much just technology wise, equipment wise, our people that work here are just top notch. Uh, you know, a lot of our job focuses around weather. You know, when it's when it's colder in town, we're going to have those wrecks. We're also going to have more house fires. Right now, we're still in a drought, even though we got a little bit of water this week. You know, we're anticipating a really bad grass fire season, just progressing into the spring and the summer. It's we're we're kind of primed for a really bad season, so we're we're anticipating that. Some things you can plan for, some things you can't, but we know that it's never going to be boring. On my time, well, we have what time off? Because <laughs> that's one thing that has really been different is uh, you're never off. When uh, the deputy chiefs and I go home, uh, you know, we sleep with our radios on. If you're not out of town, then you're not really away from the job. Now we sleep with it on, uh, on what we call TAC-3, which is like if a fire comes in or a big wreck. So we don't hear everything, but if something like that comes in, I mean, we're up. And so, and there've been several times when we've had to come in, you know, get dressed and come in just to, you know, just to help out. When you come to work and you love your job, it's not hard.